Good day, Pooter students and staff. I'm Bryce, and today's episode will look a little different. So let's get right into it. To start off, we have a few announcements. Unified basketball and wrestling are both starting up, and while we cannot attend games as spectators, let's cheer on our teams. Also, shout out to the girls' swim and dive team. They just competed in their first virtual swim meet against Monarch High School on Tuesday. Well done, swim Paulas. Now, class registration is right around the corner, and there are so many amazing classes you can take right here at Pooter. We have a couple promos, promos to run, first being digital media production. So let's see what that's about. What makes this class special is that it gives kids the opportunity to create things through the internet um, that you wouldn't be able to. For me personally, like I've always wanted to create a podcast and this class gave me that opportunity and it actually showed me that it could potentially be a career opportunity for me. I just think that it's something that you can apply to the real world every day and I think that it's a class that most people should take even though they're not like into technology more or less. Um, so like Jaden Moore, he made a podcast about baseball and sports. Um, there's a few other kids that have made videos on like mechanical, car mechanical videos. I personally made videos on my own truck of working on it. And uh, there's another kid that um, kind of just focuses on video games. So I'd say that, you know, you can pick what you want to make with your video. So it's not like you're targeted on something the teacher picked for you and you don't like it. It's something that you want and you like, and that's what makes it fun. My name is Iber. Uh One thing that I enjoy about this class is that it's self-paced. Uh, you, you do have to get products out really quickly, but I like how it's business-wise. You get to like focus on your own thing, your own passion. That's the first thing I like about this class. You, you don't get to sit in front of like a TV screen, let the teacher lecture you about this. No, it's just you do your own thing. She gives you work time. She gives you some advice, some tips to make your product be better. So that's what I enjoy about this class. What I'm doing right now is um, there's a lot of, like I always wanted to become a streamer. Digital media production is that it gives you time to figure out what you want to do in the media world and how you want to do it. So like for me, the important part in digital media production one was really finding what I wanted to do. Remember, this class counts for English credit. Another great class you can take is videography. Let's check that one out as well. Come check out videography and find your creative side of, of in film. Who are you? What is your name? My name is Miss Christy Giuliotti. This is my first year at Poudre High School and I'm excited to be teaching videography. Now, what is this class about? This is a class to get you guys to show your creative side through film. So you're going to learn different types of filming techniques, doing GIFs, stop action, documentaries, um, horror films, um, different type of film work um, to kind of touch on that creative side of filmmaking. Now, what are we going to learn in this class? You probably already answered this. It's OK. We're going to do um, some animated GIFs. Um, we're going to also in this learn um, how to make a stop action film. Also, you're going to get to watch some different films. Um, some of my favorites like the fantastic Mr. Fox. We're going to watch Jaws. Um, I have some other um, films as well we're going to watch. Hopefully we are out of remote learning and we're able to be in person so we can get a little bit more done. Um, you're going to make some independent films and you're also going to do some group work. Now, what programs are we going to be using in this class? We are going to use Adobe Rush if you are filming through your phone. We're going to use um, Adobe Premiere if you are working from a desktop. I will grant you access for both of those through the district. Um, there are also multiple other programs that you guys can use, like WeVideo, um, DaVinci Resolve. Um, I've got some extra apps for each um, project that you can also use to get your footage. 
Now, what credits do we get from this class, and where do they go? What do you mean, where do they go? Like, um, for a literature class, they go probably go towards English credits, and then there's elective credits. Where would I think it's go? electric credits because we're in the arts and humanities pathway. Okay, and how many credits is this class for? I'm pretty sure it's five credits for taking this class. All right, thanks. That's We got all that we need. Have a good hope, day. Yep, hope to have you in class. Goodbye. If you are interested in any of these classes, be sure to fill that out on your registration forms. Check with your counselor to see when exact registration dates are. It's been short but sweet, and next week we will showcase a few more programs and classes. So stay tuned. We will see you then on the PHS News.